Hello chat box is out there. Today in this vlog I'm going to be telling you guys all about what I got to on my week so far, which is my Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday of this week. I hope you guys all have been a lovely week so far. On my Monday, I got up and I had some cereal for my breakfast and we got these packs of cereals. So they had like Rice Krispies and the ones with all the fishes in, which I had, I love those ones. And then me and my younger brother were playing some games of Uno and Ludo and then our older sister came and joined us. She came down on Sunday evening to stay for the week and we were just playing some games while she was at TV and then we got ourselves ready to go off down to the swimming pool and we went in and they had the lazy river and we went down the side like twice. Then we got back and got showered and changed back at the caravan and we had some lunch there and played some more card games and I was just doing a bit of drawing, a little bit of coming in on the kind of app on my phone and just watching some vlogs and TikToks on my phone in my bedroom and was just chilling for a bit and then we headed off to go to visit our cousin as she doesn't live too far from where we were staying so we went down to hers and we met and had some tea and biscuits out in the garden and it was lovely and sunny and my younger brother got a cowboy hat from his car to put on my head so that I didn't get too hot and so I got a nice selfie wearing that and felt like a bit of a cowboy and captured it Howdy Partner, love it and hashtag yeehaw and yeah we really like that hat, I miss that hat and we had a lovely time catching up and I got two woe snaps from her garden that I'm going to show you guys now. Such a lovely garden, had a lovely time catching up with my cousin and then we made our way back on the way back we stopped off at the asda to get some bits of bobs from there and i got a pretty fast out from the flower section they had outside of the entrance to the shop that i'm going to show you guys now such a lovely flower stop i love the patterns on that flower then i got into asda and i was having a look around and i got a alvis plushy love alvis love stitch love plushies yeah, I got an Alvis Stitch plushie and I can't wait to add this to my collection. Then I got some OMG LOL dolls. This one is giving me Trixie Mattel 60s, 70s vibes with the swirly patterned colourful dress with the flared sleeves and a little belt. I just got a little trainers on with socks. I love the big eyes and the makeup. They're just so stunning. And then on the back, you can see the illustration and she's so beautiful and they change colour in the sun which is very cool. I do not think they're going to be opening these, I think I might keep them in box. And then the second one I got was this one here, she's got white and black, like hair with black streaks in her hair and she's got bows that are actually made out of her hair and she's got a lovely pink dress on and these pink boots you can see here and I just love her earrings and her necklace that has pearls on and some ribbons on and some pink sunglasses that she's got in her hand and then on the back you can see the illustration of her and yeah I love these two girls I've got here they're so stunning and I'm so happy that they are now part of my collection Soon I'm going to be running out of room. I'm planning to put some shelves up in my bedroom to put more of my inbox dolls up and quite a lot of them need to be put up. I think the walls are going to cave in at this rate because I already have a lot of shelves but I need to get those put up on shelves or maybe we get them in a display cabinet somewhere if I can find room in my bedroom. Then on the way back we got like stopped at doing traffic lights and we were in traffic for a bit and I was able to get a snap of this little bar with some flowers on that I'm going to show you guys now. Blooming traffic took ages and then we got into the high street and we went off to go to one of the restaurants in the high street that we've been to quite a lot and have some tea from there 
and just before that i popped to the sweet shop just down the road and i got this massive bag of chicken mix and i have already been much more way through this with me and my older brother me and my older sister and younger brother and my older brother and the younger sister at home and i should have done this when my younger sister facetimed who stayed back at home and it's so good and then we got into the restaurant and i had a chicken caesar side from there that we show you guys now it was one of the best sides i've ever had the chicken the bacon the peppers the lettuce everything about it was so good then on the way back we got ice creams from this ice cream place which was so good and i had a strawberry candy floss flavoured ice cream with raw gum and vanilla and the bubble gum was so good so yeah bubble gum strawberry slash candy floss flavour and a vanilla and it was so delicious we had that went back at the caravan and then we were just playing some games and some card games and board games i didn't finish writing my journal put that away just a bit of music did some drawing and colouring in on the app on my phone. I then sort out my blue tech doll and then I was just watching a bit of Netflix and then I went off to bed as I was pretty knackered. And then on my Tuesday, I got up and got ready for the day ahead, got showered and changed and had some toast and listened to a bit of music and did some drawing and colouring in and we just watched a bit of TV and then we were just playing some card games and board games and then we headed off to go to the beach and we got there and got set up and I got myself a bucket and spade from the shop, beach shop and got myself a Trista ice lolly and had that which was so good and we made the sandcastle and I want to show you guys a photo of that now so much fun building the sandcastle with me my older sister and younger brother my younger brother helped do the moat around the castle my older sister was putting the castles like on the little bit in the middle where the castle was going and i was helping to pat it down and do some of the sandcastles and my dad taught us that you put the sand in the bucket punch it down and then you put more on sweep it over and then that's how you make the perfect sandcastle and it works every time and it was just so much fun we also went into the sea and did a bit of boogie boarding and my older sister and younger brother were literally holding me up at one point i thought i was going to drown but it was so much fun we were laughing so much then we got back and got showered and changed and for tea we had pasties i had a cheese onion pasty with some chips for the fish and chip shop on the site we we're staying at and they're so good I'm going to show you guys a photo of that now. After I'd had the cheese and pasty and chips, I had a winged donut freshly made with a cup of tea. And I'm going to show you guys a photo of that now. It was so delicious. After that, we were done playing some card games and board games. I had finished writing my journal, put that away. I was just watching some vlogs and TikTok just a bit of music and just chilling in my room and then my younger brother went off home as he had to go get his jabs done for when him and his girlfriend are going off to Bali I know I'm so jealous so he had to go do that so he headed off back home and then I played a few games of Go Fish with my older sister and then I went to bed and then on my Wednesday which is today it's my last full day on holiday in the caravan as we go home tomorrow evening so yeah it's gone so quickly you know what they say time flies when you're having fun so on my wednesday which is today i got up after a lovely lion it felt so good not sharing with my younger brother and his snoring i thought at one point i was gonna have to strangle him so it was good that i was able to get a nice long sleep and not have to worry about him snoring or me waking him up because i get a bit restless but luckily i wasn't and yeah i was in a really good mood i got up i had some rice krispies for my breakfast and then 
me and my older sister are playing a few games of Uno and a few games of Dominoes. And then my grandma was just sort of stuff on the, the caravan, putting them on the caravan. My dad had gone off back to bed as he hadn't slept very well. My mum and myself were then just watching a bit of TV. And then we got ready to go off to the beach again. And I got shower and changed and headed off down to the beach with my mum, dad, grandma and older sister. And we got there and got set up and we were flying the kite that my dad had got from the shop. And I'm gonna show you a photo of that kite now. So pretty and my dad is so good at flying kites and he got it so high up in the sky. And then we were just sat enjoying the sunshine. It was so warm, I was just love it in sun cream because I burned so badly. My younger brother and older brother literally tanned so easily. But I am like Casper, the bloody ghost, and I literally burned so easily. So I made sure to have lots of sun cream on. And then we made our way back. We got back and me and my older sister were playing this Top Trump's Cats edition, which is about like the cutest cat one or the most aggressive cat. And it was quite fun. And then I sort of my British doll we with my journal, there's a bit of music, I was just watching some vlogs and TikToks and some funny cat and dog videos. I then ended up falling asleep. I then got woken up and we were going off to this restaurant in the high street that is quite fancy and looks really nice. And we saw it and thought we'd go in there and they have a rooftop terrace bit there. And we booked and got ready and head off there. We got in there and got onto the terrace where we booked our table and it was lovely and sunny so it was a lovely evening to be sat on a rooftop terrace with lovely views and we had great food. I had these wraps and they were so good, halloumi and salad and it was just mwah, French kiss and the chips were so good. I'm not really a big fan of chips but their chips are so good. I'm going to show you guys a photo of those now. I loved it. It was so good. I had a Coca Cola as well, and it was just such a lovely evening. They were so lovely, kept coming in and checking on us. And then on the way back, we got some ice cream from the ice cream place, and I again got strawberry, blueberry, and vanilla. So, yeah, candy floss. I keep saying strawberry, it's candy floss. Candy floss, blueberry, and vanilla. Three scoops and a cone and I got a photo of that that I'm going to show you guys now. So delicious, got a bit of a mess because it was dripping everywhere but it was still so delicious. In a family of big big ice cream lovers, especially my older sister, she is obsessed with ice cream and we also got donuts from there as well, did you freshly made donuts and we got quite a lot of those because my dad is a big fan of the donuts and I think if it came out of him and Homer Simpson, a few likes donuts the most, I think my dad would probably trust Homer because he is a absolute donut fiend, bless him. And I had one of those in a cup of tea, went back, and I then just finished off writing my journal for the day, put that away, finished off sorting my beautiful doll out, just watched some vlogs and TikToks, and have started to slowly pack my things away, ready for when we leave tomorrow. Like afternoon and tomorrow me and my older sister are going to go swimming and then we're going to have a little fire with my grandma and my mum and dad are going out for food in the morning because it's their 32nd anniversary which is insane and me and my older sister have got an anniversary card for, to sign for me and my siblings and then in the afternoon I think we might be going into one of the little towns to have a look around some of the shops and stuff and then we're going to be going like late afternoon early evening and yeah it's been such a lovely holiday definitely needed nicely refreshed with the sea air and lovely views of the sea and a few beach days here and there and yeah i've fully enjoyed myself and i also have next week off i was lucky to book two weeks off i'm not back in work till next saturday evening doing free till close so saturday afternoon early evening if you will and yeah gonna be a bit of a shock to the system having an eight hour shift but i get a lunch break and i've got a great 
team on in the evening so it will fly by and I'm actually very excited about getting back to work. I've missed work and my work fam and so it shall be great to get back and it'll be like I've never been away and yeah I hope you guys all have a lovely rest of your evening all have a lovely rest of your week please like comment and subscribe and I shall see you with a new vlog coming very soon bye I'm such a ninny I forgot to show you a little clip I got of the sea and I thought I'd quickly show you that now so I will leave you with this little clip for you guys to enjoy.